Hello students, Mr. Tim here from Premier Martial Arts in Aurora. Today what we're going to do is we're going to go over a martial arts workout to build our endurance and our strength while we are at home. Hopefully we do a great job doing this and this is something that we can repeat so that we can make sure we get, we're, uh, we're getting our, our physical education in for, for school. Anyway, let's get started. All right, students, before we get started with our, with our workout, let's start uh, just warming up our body. Let's start just with some arm circles. So lift that chest, keep your body straight. As we push my arm all the way down and I make the biggest circle I can with my arm. I like to do about five each direction with each arm to get started. As I'm going, I'm pressing my fingers as far away from me as I can, doing my best to get my bicep to rub my ear and then my hand to brush my side when it comes down. After we do five on one, then we'll do five the other direction. After we do that on one arm, then go ahead and repeat that on the other arm as well. All right, students, after our arm circles, let's go ahead and let's do some knee circles. Open up our hips, start activating our legs. What I want you to do first is take one knee, lift it up as high as you can right in the center of you. After you lift it all the way up in the center, then I want you to push it out as far as you can to the side, then go ahead and let that circle down. After you do a circle one way, reverse that movement right away. So now I'm just gonna pull my knee all the way out to the side and lift it up as high as I can, and then pull that one to the middle. Once I make the circle both directions, we count that as one repetition, perform five of these on each side after those arm circles. All right, students, let's get in our guard stance. Let's start our first piece of the workout. What I want us to do is we're gonna perform five jabs, then do a great push-up, and five crosses, and do another push-up, and we're gonna repeat this 10 times. I'm gonna perform three for you right here. We'll start five jabs, two, three, four, five. After five jabs, Come down to a strong position, do the best push-up I can, pop back up to my guard stance, and then five crosses. One, two, three, four, five. Again, popping right down to that strong plank, bringing my chest all the way to the floor. Back up, right away, pop it to my feet, and repeat it. Five jabs, two, three, four, five. Great push-up. Five crosses. One, two, three, four, five, and a great push -up. All right, students, repeat that sequence 10 times before moving on to the next. All right, students, our next exercise, we're gonna do a reverse lunge right into a front kick. So from, from forward, when we do a reverse lunge, I'm keeping my chest up, I'm stepping my foot back, dipping that back knee down towards the floor. Right away, once I get here, I'm gonna explode through that front leg. Right away, as I stand up, I'm chambering and firing out my front kick. Right away after that kick, go right back into that next reverse lunge, front kick, Right back, reverse lunge, front kick. From the side, I'm going, reverse lunge, front kick. Reverse lunge, front kick. Students, perform that reverse lunge to front kick 20 times on each leg before moving on. All right, students, our next exercise, we're going sit up with two hook punches each sit up. Now, starting our sit up, I wanna make sure I'm getting the full range of motion or the biggest range of motion I can. So I like to butterfly my feet by putting the soles of my feet together. I take my hands, I'll reach them as far in front of my feet as I can. I'll sit all the way down and touch the ground above my head before sitting all the way up. Now, once I get all the way up here to the sit up, then I get in my guard stance, I need to squeeze my stomach muscles, and I'm gonna perform two hook punches before going to my next sit up. Right away when I get up, again, my hands are up, I squeeze these muscles, and then it's hook punch, hook punch, before moving on. From the side, here, reach for, touch the ground, all the way back, touch above your head. As soon as we come up, right back to my guard stance, twist, two hook punches. All right, students, do your best. Don't give up, perform 50 of the sit-up hooks before moving on to the next exercise. The last exercise of the sequence is gonna be a squat with a split kick, and it looks just like this. I'm gonna start with my chest up, keeping my heels on the floor, pushing my butt back, and then squatting down as low as I can. Right away, I want to explode up, and as soon as I explode up, I'm gonna pull my knees up and perform two front kicks out on either side. Right, right away, once you bring your feet back, then we'll do it again. I'll go in heels on the ground, butt back as I squat, and exploding up, right into my split kick, just like this. All 
All right, students, have some fun with this last, with this last exercise of the sequence and perform 20 before finishing the workout. That's our workout today. Do your very best, have some fun, and I would like to, to see you guys perform this two, if not three times each week for these next few weeks. Please get, to, uh, get some clips of yourself performing some of the movements, if not the whole thing, and uh, make sure you tag Premier Martial Arts in that, uh, in that clip. Anyway, have fun, stay fit, and we'll see you next time.